The ice in the Arctic is melting, and it's thinner than ever, according to NASA scientists and researchers with the National Snow and Ice Data Center. Tom Wagner at NASA says this is a serious problem. This is probably one of the best examples of what's happening as the Earth begins to warm, probably because of greenhouse gases, you know, in the atmosphere. Scientists say 90% of the sea ice in the Arctic is only one or two years old, and therefore thin. This is up from 40 to 60% in the 1990s. Wagner says this thinner ice will lead to an increase in seasonal ice melt this year. Thicker ice lasts longer in the summer. It's more resistant to melting, more resistant to getting blown out by wind. Wagner explains that more thin ice and more melting could also increase global temperatures. Right now, the Arctic ice cap functions like a giant air conditioner for the Earth. And it's literally just a big mirror sitting up there on the top of the planet reflecting sunlight away. He says less ice leaves more ocean water exposed. Ocean water absorbs the sun's rays, warming the Earth. Wagner says the melting ice could change the Arctic's entire ecosystem, affecting the animals that live there. As it goes away, you do things like completely change the food webs, and we don't know what the impacts of those are going to be. Wagner says the scientific community needs to do a better job explaining climate change to the public. Meanwhile, at the other end of the world, the Wilkins Ice Shelf in Antarctica is on the brink of collapse. The ice bridge that held the shelf in place recently shattered, drawing more international attention to the problem of ice melt in the polar regions. Catherine Cannon, VOA News, Washington.